had um, many people email me asking me, how do you put the flight suit on and how do you take the flight suit off your birds? And um, I'm so swamp busy. I'm so sorry if I haven't replied to you yet via email. I'm like super swamped trying to deal with some pretty serious issues right now that are really taking up all my time. So I figured I'd, I'll just make one video so I can answer all those people's questions as to how I put the flight suit on and take it off. Okay, this is gonna be, this is gonna be really difficult for me to show you on camera. I'll try and do my best. Come on, Geraldine. Let's show the world how we put this on. Okay, yeah. oh, this is a good. So, this is Geraldine. So this is Geraldine. He's very used to wearing the flight suit. He's been wearing it for almost seven years. So he's had a lot of experience with it. So I'm gonna show you how I put it on him. Johnny! Yeah. He knows, he knows now that I have the suit, we're about to go on an adventure because you know, he's associated the suit with having fun, you know, going on little trips. So um, he loves going out and that's a huge benefit. I don't know if you guys can even see me, but that's the huge benefit to these suits is that I get to take them with me. Otherwise they'd be cooped up all day long and like very depressed and bored out of their minds. And now they know, you can see how happy he is. camera. I don't know, like, I'm having trouble with the, um, not having anyone filming me do this. So I just opened the suit and then I got it like this. And then he basically put his wing through. So one wing through the hole. See, he's got one wing through the hole of the suit, but this wing, the right wing hasn't been pulled through the hole yet. So when I do it, so I basically pull it like that very gently and now it's on. Usually it goes on in two seconds, but since I'm trying to demonstrate it on camera, but anyways, he's got it on him now. As you can see, he couldn't care less <laughs> that he's wearing the suit. to him now because um he's just uh busy singing oh. Joey it's my turn He does the wolf whistle, and then I'm supposed to go, and we kind of alternate. Jolene, let's do the jingle bells. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna go grab Cuckoo Nut. Uh, Cuckoo Nut is nowhere near as experienced as Geraldine is uh, wearing these suits. So Cuckoo Nut's uh, a different uh, process I use to get the suit on him. So it's just a little bit different. I'll go show you right now. Um, and the way I secure this so that, you know, he can't uh, fly away, I basically just take the little hoop on whatever I'm wearing or my underwear, <laughs> you know, because I always have underwear on. And I, you know, I just tie it. But this is it, so he's, um, you know, nice and secure. Ah! I'm not 
squashing the crap out of him when I go like, it looks like I'm squeezing him really hard, but I'm, I'm not, I'm like barely even touching him. But it looks like I'm going, I'm like killing him, but I'm not, but trust me. <laughs> and um, in case you guys are wondering, you know, these flight suits come with a leash. I don't have the leash anymore that these come with because I, 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 I threw it away because um, the leash this comes with, it basically has a big Velcro on it and you, you go like this and you, you put it on top of the Velcro. And I worry that, um, you know, the Velcro leash would come off this and then they would escape and, you know, that would be a disaster because if these birds escape, they'll get eaten by a hawk or they'll starve to death. They just, they're way too domesticated to survive in the wild. So it's super duper important. You want to make sure that your bird never ever escapes through a window or, or open door. Okay, we're enjoying fabrics right now. And in case you're wondering what material I use to um, make the bird's leash, I, I just buy this stuff. So this is super simple. So you just, so you just sew this basically into their suit, you know, into the front right there. You can see it. And that's why you don't ever have to worry about the leash um, detaching from the flight suit. So this is where I get it, Joy and Fabrics. You can also buy this, I'm sure, on Amazon. And that's why, you know, there is no way in heck that this leash can detach from the flight suit. I walked through a tornado and this thing is not going to detach from this. So I'm going to go show you guys how I put the suit on Cuckoo Nut, who's definitely nowhere near as experienced as um, Geraldine. Right, Geraldine? Okay, I'm going to go get Cuckoo Nut. because cuckoo nuts not near, nowhere near as experienced as Geraldine. I basically just take cuckoo nut like this, get the two straps on the shoulder, and then I have to put them on the table and make him walk. And that way when he walks, he puts his um, feet, feet through the holes of the suit because otherwise he sticks his feet inside the suit and then it's impossible to um, very, very gently pull the wing through the hole. So I'm going way deep in there and that way I'm more or less pushing instead of pulling the wing through the um the whole of the suit and now it's on and then i like to squeeze it like this to really make sure that the velcro is secure and now he's done <laughs> yeah okay hold on a second all right all right so that was done so you see how it's super easy i mean it's very very easy to get the suit on and uh, I don't, I couldn't really demonstrate it as much as the way I wanted to demonstrate how I, I base, how I pull the wing through the hole of the suit. But how's I can I explain this? When you're trying to pull the wing through the hole of the suit, don't grab the wing up here. Try and go further in. Here, I'll show you. let me try this way to explain it. Okay, this sucks. I don't know why it's so hard for me to explain this. So pretend like the bird is inside this suit and the bird's wings are inside the suit because you basically have to put your finger in here and pull the wing out. Don't just go like this and then pull the wing out that way. You really wanna put your fingers way as deep in there as possible. See, I'm, I'm reaching way in there. Oh, sorry, Jolene. And then I'm pulling like that. Push push it more, more push than pull, if that makes sense. Because that's why um, you're putting far less stress on the wing when you're, you're doing more of a pushing motion than, than, a, than a pulling. Because when, you're, when they're all tense and freaking out, they just, they, just don't know what, they just don't like what's going on. You know, you don't want to pull it because they're, they're tense and they're like, no, no, they don't, they don't want to extend their wing. They just want to be like, ooh. Like, but if you more push than pull, the wing will just go super smooth and it'll just go in there like nothing. I can't explain this to all you guys, it's so bad. I guess what I can best summarize it is whenever you're trying to get the wing to the hole of the suit, make sure you're reaching in there as deep as you possibly can to more push the wing through than pull, if that makes sense. Because um, unless your bird is like super duper relaxed and, and knows that he, he, need to, he, needs, he needs to go like this with his wing so he can go through the hole, it's better to push push slightly and do the pulling at, at the same time, if that makes sense. I don't know, it's so hard for me to explain. I give up. 
But that little trick I did with cuckoo nuts where I, I just, I just stick, put the suit up to his chest and then I put him on the table so he starts to want to run and that way his little feet, you know, pop out of the suit because otherwise his feet are stuck in the suit and then it's like impossible for me to um, pull the wings through when, when he's pushing the suit down with his legs, with his legs inside the suit. So if you're ever in a position where you, um, you get the suit on halfway and you can't go any further because their, their legs are stuck inside the suit, you have to make their legs pop out of the suit so that you can pull their wings through the hole of the suit. Just stick them on the table and then they're going to want to run and then they'll take their own legs by themselves out of the suit and then you can easily pull their wings, pull, push their wing through the hole of the suit. <laughs> I really suck at explaining this. I, I did my best, you guys. The, the more you do it, the more you'll um, understand what I mean. You just want to be super careful when you're pu you are pulling the pushing, pulling, whatever you want to say, the wings of the bird to the hole of the suit. You definitely want to do it very, very gently. So. Don't remove the Asian lama a long, long time ago. This is the time of the apocalypse. The dream of the lasting peace I tell you what Value your modern life